On June 19th and 20th, a typhoon slammed into Japan and the Fukushima prefecture. Here's a picture of the reactor from SOT.net prior to the typhoon. This is a recent picture. I don't know when it was taken. But this is about what's left of the Fukushima reactor number four with the spent fuel rods um, in it, sitting above the reactor itself. Now here's this article from TEPCO going back to April 13th, 2011. TEPCO confirms reactor number four spent fuel pool is now an uncontrolled open air fission process. Now here I want to find this article by um, Mike Adams, Natural News. He states the resulting releasing of radiation would turn North America into a dead zone for humans, mutated and failed crops, radioactive groundwater, skyrocketing infant mortality, an explosion in cancer and infertility. This is what would be unleashed at any moment from an earthquake in Japan. Well, by the looks of this building, I don't think it's going to take an earthquake of 7.0 or anything really of that magnitude for this thing to completely collapse. <coughs> uh, he goes on to say such an event could result in the release of 85 times the cesium-137 released by the Chernobyl catastrophe. And the Chernobyl catastrophe made its surrounding regions uninhabitable by humans for centuries. Yet, again, nothing is being discussed about this in the news. No warnings, no updates, no precautions being given to the people, if you could even imagine precautions in a disaster of this magnitude. If the contamination of the entire northern half of the Pacific Ocean and everything in it wasn't enough to cause an outcry by every human being on the planet, we're now facing the imminent collapse of reactor number four. It's not a question, I don't think, anymore of if it will collapse, but when. I just want to give you some pertinent information because the government won't. The bomb dropped on Nagasaki, Japan, was contained about 13.6 pounds of enriched nuclear materials. There are 1,535 spent fuel rods or 460 tons of enriched nuclear fuel sitting in the spent fuel pool in reactor number four. This is equivalent to 920,000 pounds of enriched nuclear material. The fuel rods weigh 3.3 tons each. Now to put this in perspective, okay, if that fuel pool goes, that will be equivalent to 67,647 nuclear bombs exploding simultaneously or 67,647 Nagasaki's going off at once. This is an extinction level event. Whether it be extinction level to the extent it is most of all life on the planet or all of all life on the planet. Just something th to think about and some information you'll get here because the government won't give it to you. Are you still sleeping? Are you awake yet?